Hello YTPC, I'm Michael, the Guilty Pleasures Piper, and I'd like to welcome you to my channel at This Old Pipe. So today, I wanted to bring you another uh, Cobb Tuesday. So my offering for today will be another creation that I've come up with. This is a Patriot. that I've changed the stem on. Put a little acrylic stem on it, short, shorter than the original. I've added a little hemp rope to the shank so that I could build out the shank so as to be as thick or as wide as the stem. Great little pipe. Okay. Well, let me, uh, so to, in, in the uh, cob today, I'm having uh, my Northwoods from uh, Boswell's. And uh, what a great blend. Northwoods is a little bit harder to keep, keep lit sometimes because they have the uh, bigger the, the coarser uh, tobacco versus uh, the ribbon, it's, it's more coarse. So you really have to stay on top of it. Of course, if you're relaxing and sitting back like you should be, smoking your pipe and enjoying it, then it's a Kind of an easy, easier smoke for sure. So today I wanted to bring another another little uh, tool that I have created to help assist in cleaning up around the rim of the of the cobs. I've also used this on briar pipes, but what I have here. Uh, it's a little strange looking, but this is called a peg people. Peg people can be purchased at any of your craft stores, like Michael's or Hobby Lobby's or, or any, you know, possibly even on Amazon online. Peg, peg people. So what I do is I put sandpaper on the bottom. I put sandpaper all around it, around the bottom there. That helps to, to assist. I also put sandpaper strips across the, the top of it. Now what that does for me is it creates a, a uh, like a, a, a wedge angle that will easily fit right into the, the front of the cob and as you rotate it and basically you're sanding out any of the any of the parts of the cob that that build up with uh, you know you're burning the top of your cob of course with your lighter you know uh, any of that burning can be taken away that charring so to get the flat part of the cob just flip it around Flip it around and then and then just rub it across the top of the cob and you'll very easily take care of cleaning and maintaining your your cob. Some cobs I don't do this way because I simply want to keep a little bit of charring on top. But the ones that I want to stay clean, I use a little tool, the peg people. Now the peg people comes in a package like this. Let me put my pipe down. This is what I got. And there again, you know, it's, it's a simple little piece, but it works really well for our pipes. Now I have used this also on briar pipes whenever I'm cleaning up the rim as well. And it works really well, really good. 
You just got to be careful that you don't take too much out of the briar. All right. Well, I hope everyone's enjoying their Cobb Tuesday today. And uh, smoking your favorite tobacco. If anyone wants to comment in my video or like, it's greatly appreciated. All right, back to smoking my pipe. And you have a wonderful afternoon. We'll see you later.